My name is Nicole Amato, but everyone calls me Nix. I am a celebrity trainer, masseuse nutritionist here in California. The word artist means to me creative, someone who is always challenging themselves, someone's always going above and beyond to be different, to be more than what's expected. I think I've always been in fitness. My parents put me in literally everything since I started walking. I love being an athlete. I was in dance, to gymnastics, to tennis. But if you see who I am and what I do and why fitness is so important to me is to keep my mind right, but I love to help other people get their mind right. Because it's not just about biceps and crunches, it's about mental gain and it's about surviving and conquering every day. Do I think that working out is physical or mental? I think it's more than that. It's physical, mental, it's social gain, it's everything and it sounds really silly, but physically, yes. Physically, you want to look good, but you can't actually get here without mental discipline. You can't do this without mental gain. And to be mentally and physically in this form, that means that's a, that's a very disciplined person. But honestly, just like for me, the trick is to like immediately when you wake up, put on your workout clothes. You have like more of the, the will to go to the gym. I know it sounds silly, but just try it. Buy like a really expensive pair of jeans that is almost your size and then make those your motivational pants. But like whatever you gotta do to motivate yourself to get back or remember how you used to be where you wanna go again or get to that goal. Um, but Body by Nix is I'm a trainer, obviously. I'm a masseuse, nutritionist, a healthy meal prep chef. So I'm kind of like your best friend who helps and coaches you back into getting into the best person that you can possibly be. What goes on in one of my sessions, obviously you have an hour and a half with me, not just an hour, because I believe that you need anywhere from 45 to 55 minutes of actual training, um, unless there's certain days, but there's always 15 minutes dynamic and then 15 minutes of static stretching afterwards because a lot of my clients seem to think that that is not important, but then they pull a muscle and <laughs> that's why. I can train you anywhere, anytime. I can train you right here, I can train you on that curb. I don't even need weight. So I believe in a lot of plyometrics, your own body weight, flexibility, and endurance. Best advice I've ever been given, oh, my mom would say there's a lot of things, but to never give up. Even when times are hard, even when you are, it's like, you could use that in life, or you can use it when you're at the gym. When you're about to hit that wall and you're at your breaking point, just go a little bit further. Just keep going, and then once that wall's down, then you've just got this extra energy and it's actually an incredible thing to feel that high. I love anything that just challenges me or anything in the water. Um, and I love to run. My thing is I run. I run at least 10 miles once a week and five days a week, anywhere from four to six every day. If I could have any superpower, it would either be to fly or to be invisible. Because if I could fly and there's an earthquake, I can park wall right out of here. But um, being invisible, it'd be nice to be able to eavesdrop on all the fitness tips that all these other people won't like share with you. I wanna know what's going on with some of these people. So intelligence without ambition is a bird without wings. If you don't have the skills to get here, like a lot of people have the same ideas for instance, but if you don't have the, the closing factor, you don't have the drive, you don't have the actual, you're not willing to actually take the step, then it's, there's, no, there's no point to your dream. Thanks guys for listening to me and hearing me out. I encourage you guys all to do something that challenges you every day, whether it's in the gym, whether it's in the workspace, whether it's dealing with a relative. And I also challenge you to do one good deed a day, like whether that's handing a bottle of water to someone in need, whatever it is, it's just good karma. So follow me at Body by Nix. You can also follow me on my Snapchat because I do do a lot of giveaways every Sunday. So make sure you stay tuned for that.